in this case why the pickers did not harvest this fruit and that's just really what we call bunch stem necrosis and you can see right here where the bunch stem itself got necrotic and it dried up and again here for some reason we notice it more in Cabernet than any other variety. Cabernet seems to be the predominant variety, varietal cultivar that has a lot more bunch stem necrosis throughout the vines. And it can start down here on the bottom, or in this case it was right here. And that is not from wind whipping this around, it just like a cluster collapse. Uh, some research have shown it could be nutrient deficient, whether it's magnesium, manganese. Uh, the jury's still out on this. Um, but again, the pickers know there's no reason to pick it because the winery's not going to accept it, and there's no weight to it. Again, if they're getting paid by the ton, they might as well just leave it and forget it. So you see it periodically, some of the other clusters, such as this, which was probably fell off when they were harvesting as part of the bunch stem necrosis versus these older dried clusters which we cut off from the short shoots or wings and shoulders uh, uh, from a while ago. On this cane, this cluster here suffered, but the cluster above it is fine, and as well as all these clusters over on either side. Here's another example where this cluster has really suffered some significant damage at some point in time, whereas over here, this would be our normal dehydration at this point, uh, signaling that, that this fruit is ready for harvest. You know, they like to see a little dimpling, if you will, or a little bit of um, raisining. You can see a little bit here again, this is some late stages of bunch stem necrosis. A little bit right here. I mean, it doesn't happen at the, always at the very top. It can happen anywhere within the cluster. And again, uh, we're not really 100% sure what causes it and what's the remedy for it. But it can become significant as the length of days to harvesting the fruit, it's delayed.